Doctor, it's such an honor. I'm so glad we weren't forced to kill you. Don't make our guest any more nervous than he already is. The Republic only kills in self-defense. As I saw in our flight from Sanctuary, you specialize in artful property damage. Now that you're here, what can you tell us about Isotope 5? How does it fuel the Ark? Isotope 5. Tomorrow's great discovery at the center of Macab. Something truly unique in all the galaxy, and worth destroying this planet to obtain. Imagine a substance as light as shimmer silk, but stronger than durasteel. It distorts gravity and electromagnetic fields so predictably that it can be refined into fuel. Isotope 5 has limitless potential to remake this galaxy. Those droids you battled were first-generation prototypes. Playthings. In Tabaro's hands, these weapons will oppress entire sectors. The cartel will become as bad as the Empire. Maybe worse. More profitable than the Imperials, one would hope. Honestly, we don't know how they support themselves. I crafted a beautiful set of Isotope 5 fuel rods to power Taboro's Ark. Some of my finest work, but you'll never see it. According to my data stream, Taboro has increased mining production to maximum levels. McKeb's destruction will arrive far ahead of schedule. You have a spacecraft, yes? We should depart immediately. We won't abandon millions of McKeb refugees. You said you could help us get the fuel rods back. That was before I saw the latest updates on Taboro's drilling operations. The mining platforms are massive lasers drilling directly into the planet. Shutting them down would release core pressure and buy us time. Attacking the mining platforms would be suicidal. Even worse, it might kill me. Wait, why do I get the feeling you're serious? What does Tabaro have guarding these mining platforms? With a steady supply of raw isotope 5, my former employer can power a multitude of devices designed to exterminate all trespassers. We need to deactivate all of Tabaro's mining platforms. That's the only way to slow McKeb's destruction until we can get the Ark's fuel rods. I fear it won't be as easy as flipping switches. The platforms and their control rooms will be heavily defended. Everything on this planet has been an ordeal. I'd hate to break our perfect record. But don't worry. Those drilling lasers are going offline. If they don't, I doubt we'll see each other again. I'll have a transport to the mining platforms prepped for you immediately. Keep us apprised of your progress. Thanks for the assist. Private Vandalic, 8th Imperial Infantry. Might keep your distance. Insects leaking out. Don't try to move. We'll transport you out of here. Generous, but a waste of effort. Not much time. So listen. Wasn't always Imperial military. Born on Macab. Caught wind of the hot takeover. And volunteered for this. I'll defend my old home. Now you don't sound like a typical Imperial. Didn't realize the military was recruiting outside their space. Was this or mining? Bad choice, looking back. Or as were to steal Isotope 5. But I wanted to help your evacuation. Still have friends and family here. Shutting down drills, not enough. Need to open emergency release valves at primary control center. Reduce core pressure. Where is this primary control center? We'll go right away. Have the coordinates. Controls are locked down. You'll need help. Use slicer spike in control center's mainframe. Override HUD security lockout. Take control. Vent the core. Control center's heavily guarded. Sorry, that part's on you. Please get my people off this rock. On my honor as a Jedi, your loved ones will be saved. I believe you. Wish I could stay. Lambda, Gez, we're at the drilling site's primary control center. An Imperial soldier, an ex-native, told us to open the emergency release valves. And he said it was the only way to release planetary core pressure. Do you agree? Tectonic vibrations are still off the charts. Coranto Mesa just exploded. Good thing we're not there. Those drilling lasers were working overtime. The heat buildup beneath the planet's crust is massive. Venting the core would cool things off. Sounds like it's our only option. Slicing the mainframe now. It's working. Reading shows 
seismic activity falling quickly. That should buy you enough time to get the Ark's fuel rods. And we're still cutting it awfully close. Can we use this equipment to reverse the core's damage? Well, if we had months, maybe. But we don't. We've had an interesting development while you were gone. Dr. Ogarab isn't the only hut on Makeb who's changing sides. The local hut cartel leaders, minus tomorrow, want to negotiate with you personally. Hurry back to camp and meet us in the diplomatic tent.